Hi, I'm Robert Gendron. Today I want to show you how Vicor has improved on point of load buck regulators and introduced the newest additions to the PyCor CoolPower ZVS buck regulator series. Our CoolPower ZVS buck regulators are meeting the industry demand for point of load regulation. Let me explain why. The industry is demanding higher and higher performance from point of load regulation. Meeting these demands requires higher VN and higher switching frequency performance. Conventional regulators using a hard switching topology are hindered by the switching losses in making any dramatic improvement in performance. So while we've seen improvements in silicon integration, MOSFET technology, packaging, these switching losses still dominate. Only by attacking the topology itself of the regulator can you really make any significant improvement in decreasing switching losses. And that's where ZVS comes in. The PyCor PI33 series of CoolPower ZVS buck regulators are the only buck regulators that integrate this proprietary ZVS topology. Comparing a simplified block diagram of a ZVS buck to a conventional buck, you see that the ZVS has a clamp switch around the output inductor. Simply enough, this clamp switch enables zero voltage switching. By doing so, we reduce the high side MOSFET or Q1 turn on losses. We also reduce the gate drive and body diode conduction losses. In this more detailed comparison, highlighting timing and waveforms, I'll briefly highlight for you how ZVS reduces Q1 turn on losses. Prior to Q1 turning on, ZVS buck turns on the clamp switch, creating a resonance which slowly raises the switching node or VS. Raising the switching node voltage decreases the Q1's VDS allowing for Q1 to turn on with almost zero voltage across the FET and almost zero power dissipated during turn on. In contrast to conventional buck, when Q1 turns on, it experiences a large VDS, which results in a power loss. With ZVS reducing switching losses, we can enable higher switching frequency, input voltages and output currents without conventional loss and efficiency. Now let's take a closer look at the CoolPower ZVS buck regulators. The entire portfolio operates over a wide input range of 8 to 36 volts. These devices are simple to use and you'll see at the same time that we offer a rich feature set. And like all our Vicor products, we offer high efficiency. These products are also on a common high density package platform. With an 8 to 36 volt input range, our devices give you the option for possibly eliminating a regulator stage in your design which increases your power density, frees up more space on the board, increasing your reliability, and in most cases, increases your cost performance. Operating at a high VN can dramatically reduce line losses within your system. In this example, approximately a 7% gain can be achieved by distributing 24 volts within your system as opposed to 12 volts. Your numbers and efficiency savings may vary from this, but one thing that will not change is that power loss is equal to I squared R. The ZVS bucks offer current up to 15 amps. You can achieve even higher output current by paralleling these devices. We enable simple parallel operation via a single wire current sharing scheme. You can take two buck regulators, run them in parallel, and you'll be assured of equal loading on each buck. And the two regulators will also be 180 degrees out of sync with each other, reducing the output ripple accordingly. You can parallel more than two devices and have them interleaved using the optional I squared C functionality to program in phase delay for each regulator. With the optional I squared C interface, you can program not only the phase delay, but you can also program the assertion polarity to the enable pin and the synchronization pin. You can also, on a dynamic basis only, margin the output, which can be handy while you are developing your design. In addition, you have fault telemetry, which can be read back via the I squared C line. You can report on multiple faults including over temperature protection, fast current limit, output voltage high, input over voltage, input under voltage, controller VCC under voltage. To help in programming the device and or exploring the fault telemetry, we offer a development tool that has a simple interface to work with the ZVS bucks. The buck regulators are easy to use. You don't have to be a power engineer to use cool power ZVS buck regulators in your application. The ZVS buck regulators require only an external inductor 
and minimal ceramic capacitors for input and output filtering to form a complete high performance buck regulator. No frequency compensation, parametric settings, or incremental external components are required. Let's move from ease of use to look at more closely at the efficiency advantage. Displayed in the graphs are the efficiency levels for 12 volt, 24 volt, and 36 volt input ZVS buck regulators. As you can see, the PI33 buck regulators enable high voltage input regulation at high efficiency levels. This high efficiency is maintained at full load and also at light load. Again, the high efficiency levels are enabled by the ZVS topology integrated into a low impedance SIP package. This cool power SIP packaging is a major factor in the power density of the buck regulators. The PI33 series buck regulators are available in a 10 by 14 by 2.56 millimeter land grid array system in package. The land grid array is composed of 140 land sites or connections and provides the lowest thermal and electrical impedance contact to the board. In addition, the PI33 series is all pin for pin so that devices within the series can be interchanged with no layout adjustments required. Coupled with Vicor's broad range of solutions for power delivery to the board, we are enabling optimal power efficiency throughout the power chain, right to the point of load. The PI33 series is the initial offering of what will be a comprehensive product family of high density, high performance ZVS point of load regulators. Future products in the series will include boost and buck boost regulators. For further information about Vicor's buck regulators, please visit our website. Thank you.